Recording in progress. Ha, hello. Hello, hello, guys. What is happening? I look super. Hello, teacher. Hello, Ruben. Good evening. Hi, teacher. Do you? I'm fine. Thank you for asking. I don't know why I have this problem. Es la dimensión, la, la tercera dimensión. <laughs> ok. Está raro. Hello, Juan. Wendy. Hello, hello. Te mira cortado, Juan. Ahí ya mira. ¿Cómo? Sí, ya, ya me vi. <laughs> Ese me veo muy negro. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Pero es que la bajo así para verme clarito, saludos, que se vea así muy negro. Ya parece, ya parece Nelson con la pantalla de banda bloqueada, ¿se acuerda? En el primer, en el primer mundo. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, Wendy. Everybody knows, it's just uh, uh, Rubén, Sandra, and, and Juan José, just three people. <laughs> How are you guys? I'm fine. Excellent. Are you guys ready? I have my dinner right now. Right now? Yes. <laughs> okay. Enjoy. Thank you. Yes. Yo solo, yo solo arroz con leche. How are you, teacher? Ay, qué rico. Ayer comí yo. Ah. Hoy estoy comiendo chuco. <laughs> Había limpiado por lo menos. I'm fine. I'm fine, Wendy. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for asking. I am a little tired. Yes. But I'm fine. I'm fine. Yes. What about you, Wendy? How are you? Uh, my day, um, super relaxed. Really? <laughs> you didn't work yes. today? Uh, I had uh, a great day. A work? I'm sorry. Yes, oh, I wow. um, I see my boyfriend. <laughs> All right, you see your boyfriend. That's good. That's good. I'm happy for you. Es que casi no lo puedo ver todos los días por eso. Why not? What is the problem? Lo iba a ver. Es que como él sale a las cuatro y media y yo salgo a las cuatro, verdad? Pero yo lo espero siempre a él. Pero no. cuando yo salgo a las seis, me toca, o sea, se va a él, no, él no me, no, no me espera, va muy tarde. <risa> Entonces, se me hace más fácil esperarlo a él que él a mí. Ah, oh, ok, that's y good. Hoy, that's good. en la mañana, por pura coincidencia, lo vi. Ah, oh, ok. No lo habíamos good. planeado. Ah, <risa> oh, ok. I'm happy for you, Wendy. Thank you. Yo más, teacher. Yo más. <laughs> excellent, excellent. Así me, gusta, día, la verdad. así me gusta verla más alegre. And, and y yo divorciándome. <laughs> ¿Cómo? Y yo divorciándome, le dije. Ay, no, hombre. Búsquese otra. <laughs> sí, ya está, por eso me voy a divorciar. Ay, oh, qué malo. Okay. Pues sí. Buenos. Ya se va a acabar el mundo, tenemos que aprovechar. Y me sé que. <laughs> Enjoy Juan. Nelson, hello Nelson, how are you? Good evening, welcome. Hello teacher, how are you? I'm fine, thank I you. I am fine. Excellent. Are you? Much energy. All right, all right. Me too, look excellent. <laughs> Much energy, energy. No, no, the Isabel. <laughs> no, it's just much, <laughs> much problem in in Juhar. No, no, no. Maybe in the future, but not right now. No, I'm, I'm, just, I'm okay. No, it's, it's, it's from last week, from last week. Yeah, today I feel perfect. Okay. How was your day? <laughs> Nelson, how are you? Sorry. Ah, I'm fine. Happy? Very, very happy. 
Excellent, excellent. That's pretty happy. All right, that's perfect. That's perfect. Fantastic, fantastic. Yeah, Ruben, hello, Ruben. How are you, Ruben? Hi, teacher. I am fine. Are I am happy? very happy. Excellent. I am excellent. very happy. I'm right. ready. <laughs> ready, exactly. Yeah, that's true. That's, true. that's good, that's good, that's good. Fantastic. Hello, Rosanna. Good evening. Hello, teacher. How are you, Rosanna? Um, so, so. Why? What happened? Um, I'm un poco cansada. A little tired? Yeah. <laughs> I can relate. I can relate. Sí. All right, all right. Very good. The good thing is that you are here. Rosana, and I'm happy to that, that, that you are in the class again. Josue, hello, Josue. Josue, are you there? No, Morales, Josue Morales, hello. Well, he cannot hear me, he cannot hear me. JJ, how are you, JJ? I'm fine, teacher. Are you? I'm okay. I'm happy. Are you happy? Yes. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, guys. Uh, as an activity, I need you. I need you. Everybody, hello. Una pequeña corta dinámica. Quiero que todos escriban el nombre de una persona en un papelito. Okay. Lo pueden hacer. Escribirlo. Yes. ¿De una persona del grupo o de.? No, no, no. Conocido suyo, sea cercano, familia, amigo, lo que sea. You finish? Yes. Only name. Yes, just the name. Just the oh, name. Oh, 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 last name. No, the name. Just the name. One, one name is okay. okay. Just the first name is okay. All right. Ready? Yes. I cannot show you my my name because I'm I'm this here. All right. Now. Can you please can you please show me the name here in the camera in the piece of paper? I cannot see it, Nelson. Now? No, no impossible. <laughs> impossible. Okay. Yo tengo problemas con la cámara, teacher. Lo puedo escribir en el chat. Ah, okay, okay. It's okay. Do Dam, da, Dam, Damela. Daniela. Dan. <laughs> Sorry, Daniela. All right, all right. Juan Jose. Hello, hello teacher. teacher. Manuel. Manuel, what, Wendy? Hello, hello, Wendy. <laughs> hello, Oscar. Sorry. <laughs> hello, Wendy. Manuel Derecho. Alberto. Alberto. Yeah. <laughs> And Nelson, he says, uh, I don't know Nelson. All right. Juan Jose, Juan, Juan Jose, JJ, mm -hmm. who, who is Daniela? Can you, can you tell me a, a little bit about Daniela? <laughs> can you tell me a little bit about Daniela? No. Que me cuente un poco de Daniela. En inglés. Yes. <risa> eh, yo, yo no. No sé cómo decírselo. 
Ajá. Is, is, está difícil. <laughs> she's beautiful. She's smart. Por ella, por ella se está divorciando, dice. <laughs> no, no creo. <laughs> No por ella, pero me ha convencido. Ella me ha convencido. Okay, Yo soy okay. un elfo libre. Ajá. Uh, uh -huh. JJ. Sí, y is, Daniela is my co-worker, co se dice. Uh -huh. Is intelligent. Uh -huh. Is crea creativa. Creative. Y, Ah. Friend, good friend. Continue. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay, okay, that's okay. Uh, Wendy, can you mention, can you say your person, please? Manuel, who is Manuel? Excuse me, Manuel is my boyfriend. Okay, can you tell me a little bit about Manuel? <laughs> mm, he is um, 39 years old mm -hmm. and is, is intelligent. Um, how do you say tímido? Shy. He is shy. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> um, he is very reserved, very quiet. But he is so cute. <laughs> but so cute. Um, um, Work and mm. mm, very handsome. <laughs> okay. Usted está muy enamorada. Está muy enamorada. Sí. All right. Yes. I'm, I'm happy for you. I'm happy for Thank you. All right. Fatima, can you participate? I don't think so. Good evening. Yes, teacher. I'm here. All right. Who is Rosa Fatima? Hello, Carlos. Good evening. Rosa is my mom. Is very intelligent and is a beautiful person. And I don't know, teacher. Uh, is crazy. Crazy. And Yes, my mom is es como chistosa. Ah, ok, ok. <laughs> ¿Y divertida? She's funny. Ajá, uh -huh. she's funny. Maybe, maybe she's my mother. My mother, no. No. is my mother. Oh, ok. <laughs> ok. <laughs> my mother no, is no. funny. Ok, excellent, excellent. Rubén, who is Alba? Rubén, who is Alba? We lost Rubén. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Well, we lost him. He's, he's having internet problems. All right. Hello, let me see, please say that. Welcome, Daniel, tell me. Carlos and Daniel, welcome, Mauricio. I'm happy to see you guys back here. All right, let me take attendance and then we start with the class, all right? Yeah, just let's do that. Let's see, Briseida Jamilet Diaz Gonzalez. Present teacher. Carlos Maria Vendaño Peña. Present teacher. Sí. Carlos, are you drinking something? Permit. Ya te hablo. 
Perdón, es que me había hablado mi mamá ahorita. Mándeme. Oh. Are you drinking something? Some medication? Eh, que no, si I'm, tomo alguno. Yes, I'm asking because you are early in the class today. Ajá. You are early. Perdón, no le, no, no, no le entendí. <laughs> No, I'm asking you if you are taking medication. For health daily. No, because you are early in the class. <laughs> the second time. The second time, Carlos. <clears throat> second time. I'm going to break my record. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> Carlos. <laughs> Carlos René Rivas López, no, right? He's not here yet. Uh, Delmi Guadalupe Gómez Landa Verde. Present. Fátima Gabriela Córdoba Rosales. Present, teacher. Hello. Francisco Nemías Godínez Urquía. He's not here with us yet. Graciela Janet Melara de Cruz. She's not here with us yet. Jose Daniel Meneses Bolaños. Hello. Present, teacher. Uh, Juan José Portillo Durán. Hello. Hello. Juan Josué Morales Pérez. Okay. Mario Alexander Artea Campos. Maura Estela Orantes Fernández. Nelson Domínguez Díaz Alas. Present. Noé Ortiz Carrillo. Oscar Mauricio Montenegro. Present. Presente. Reina Margarita Martínez de Castillo. Roxana Elizabeth Méndez Melara. Present. Rubén de Jesús Campos Gómez. Presente, teacher. Sandra Elizabeth Díaz Torres. She's here. Wendy Doménica García. I'm good, teacher. All right, all right. Very good, very good. Excellent. Guys, we're going to start right now. Today we have a lot to do. Lot to do. Okay. And let's start. Let's not waste time. Let's do this. Do you guys see the presentation? Sorry, I have a problem here. Let me share again. All right, guys, do you see the presentation now? Yes, yes teacher, I see it. All right, very good, very good. Let's start. Today, we are going to learn how to use past to be and simple past in the affirmative form. So today's class is going to be about past, about simple past, all right? This class or this topic is very, very, very important and essential, all right? So we're going to practice a lot about the past today. This is class number 11, Tuesday, November 16th, 2021. Today we start week number three. Okay, today we start week number three. Let's start. Now, guys, I'm going to show you, it says here, can you good reading activity. I'm going to show you a paragraph, okay? And you are going to complete some information about that paragraph, okay? 
Yes, are you guys ready to see the paragraph? Yes, teacher. All right. Let's, can you see it? ¿Lo pueden ver? No? Eh, solamente la presentación del... De la... ¿No lo pueden ver? No? Solo la indicación. Solo la indicación, teacher. All right. I, that's, that's weird. Hello, hello, Stella. Hello, Margarita. Welcome. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, good evening. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, Stella. Here, guys, it is here. Okay, it says can and could, all right? Can and could. And then we have here a paragraph. Let's read, guys, read the paragraph and then it says answer these questions according to the text. What, how old is Samira Brown? Can she jump? That's the second question. And then read the text again and try to complete the table about Samira. Okay, leamos la información acerca de Samira y luego contestamos las preguntas acerca de ella. Okay. Guys, did you finish? No teacher. No teacher. Daniel is, is angry. <laughs> ya le apague el micrófono, ok. <laughs> Relax, be happy. <laughs> Guys, did you finish? finish? All right, all right, thank you, thank you. 
No, teacher, no, teacher. Y apenas y logró ver la letrita. Ah, <risa> imposible. Yes. Desde aquí la veo yo. Está como a tres metros de ahí, de mí, de lejos. <risa> Finish, teacher. Excellent. Hold on. Thank you, teacher. Yes. All right, guys. In uh, in the first part, we have how old is Samira? How old is she, people? How old is Samira? She is. She is seventy. Seventy years old. She is 70 years old, all right? She's 70 yes, years so, old. Yes. Can she, the second question is, can she jump? No. No. Yeah. Yes. She, uh, <laughs> she was can. She could. Podría. No, she can. Uh -huh, she can't, not in the present, okay? Can. Not in the present. Entendí mal la pregunta, Sí, también entendí mal la pregunta. Okay, then we have ability in the past, guys. Rom, jump, Rome, gym, Rome, tennis, gym, play Practice tennis. tennis. Okay, she could, she could play tennis, she could run, she could, uh, I don't know what else she said there. Uh, what, run and jump. Now, what about ability in the present, guys? Read book, visit many places. And um, watch, watch there is some on TV. TV. Okay, yeah. she can read books, she watch can TV. visit many places, and she can watch many programs on TV, right? Yes, very good, guys. Very good, very good. Excellent. Okay, we finish with that part. Now we continue, we go back to the presentation. And in the presentation, it says, well, you need three customer service students right now. Go to page 29. According to the presentation, we're going to go to page 29, part one. Okay. Let's go. Let's go to the book. Open your books on page 29, everybody. Page 29. Okay. Let's go over there. Hello, Graciela. Welcome. Hello. Okay. Thank you. Thank Hi. you, teacher. Hi. How are you? I'm fine. Thank you. I'm sleepy. <laughs> fine. Mm. But sleepy. Me too. <laughs> Me too. Don't worry. <laughs> it's no money. Cansado. Con sueño. Y sin dinero. Mm -hmm. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't right. worry, teacher. La vida sigue. <laughs> All right. Guys, are you on page 29? Yes. Yes, yes teacher. All right. 
Look, guys, we have we have unit three. Today we start unit three. As you can see, unit three is about is about customer service. Customer. customer service. Okay, so the unit is going to be about this topic, customer service, and we're going to learn vocabulary related to customer service. Now, in this class today, guys. The objective for this class is that I will be able to process and understand customers' opinion about a product or service they received, okay? The, the, uh, the objective or the purpose for the class today is that I will be able to process and understand customers' opinion about a product or service they received. And let's just start with number one, la lengua, perdón. <laughs> Me dolió. <laughs> Tiene hambre, teacher. <laughs> you hungry? I'm hungry. No, I'm not hungry. I'm not hungry. He comido demasiado todo el día. Okay, guys, part, part one. Let's start. Ask a partner, why do customers call? How can you help them? Write a list of ideas. Guys, let's go, let's go over here. Let me copy the questions. Okay, look guys, uh, the question is why do customers call? Can you, how can you help them? And then it says, write a list of ideas. Guys, give me, give me a list of ideas on why customers call. Why do customers call people? Por qué llaman los, los, los clientes? Tell me. ¿Y cómo les puedo ayudar? Deme una lista. Let's, let's do this together. By eh, product? How do, you, how do you say defectuoso? To buy a product. To report a defective. Defectuoso. Yes. What else, people? Need Dogs. help uh, about about uh, product. Sorry. Need he need help about uh, product. About the product. Uh huh. Okay. They need help about the product. What else? Because your product not not arrive on time. Okay. The product. Did. Ah, excellent, excellent. Continue, people, continue, continue. Uh, ask, ask for offers. Uh -huh, to ask for offers. What else? <laughs> Sorry. I... Contrato, teacher in English. Can you repeat, Estrella? I, I couldn't. Cancelar hear. contrato. Oh, okay, okay. Yes. To cancel a contract. What else? Uh, problem of, of service. Me teacher for for bitter care y more comfortable 
confortable product. Produ no hay interferencia. Uh, the, the change of plan. Of plan. Change of plan. plans. Okay. Plan. Fabrizio, can you repeat? Is a for better care y more confort, confortable producto. Ah, que no, no le comprendo muy, muy bien. El cliente puede llamar por una atención mejor y por mejora de producto. Ah, oh, ok. To express. Mm -hmm. Okay, Sandra, hello. Can tell me? Hello, teacher. To request information for about a service. Thank you. Tell me. To make purchase order. To what? Sorry. You repeat. I, I to, ma to make purchase order. All right, Daniel. <laughs> payment, payment of service. Uh -huh. Contract renovation. Uh huh. Contract arrangements. Okay, guys, we can continue. We can continue with a long, long list of, of uh, alternatives. Okay, we can continue with more. But we just <coughs> we, have, we have just mentioned a few a few of the, of the reasons of the reasons why clients call or customers call. Let's move on here. Let's move on. All right, guys, do you have any questions? No, teacher. Okay, then, very good. Let's continue okay. then. Here. Now, we're going to continue with the second part. Okay, the second part is this one. I am going to, I am going to read these words, this vocabulary here. And we're going to make, oh, I'm going to give you a definition for the vocabulary. And then we're going to practice with this vocabulary. Number one, it says, pick up the phone. Guys, what is pick up the phone? Levantar el teléfono. Okay. Pick up the phone, responder. All right. Responder la llamada. All right. Then we have understand. Understand. What is understand? Entender. Comprender. Lo que no se puede con las mujeres. Comprender. Ah. Imposible. Es correcto, teacher. Es correcto, teacher. Es correcto. Es machista. Llamarlas. Yes. <laughs> Guys, relax, relax. <laughs> Los hombres también son iguales, teacher. No, 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 no. No, no, no. No, no. no Fátima. No, hay niveles, hay niveles. La mayoría somos casi santos. Oh, oh. Sudamos agua bendita. Somos cariñosos. Tampoco, tampoco. All right, guys, uh, understand. Very good. Nos va a caer un rayo en seco. It's true. Okay. Uh, explain, people. Explicar. Right? Complain. What is complain? Quejarse. Yes. Complain. Quejarse. All right. Quejarse. <coughs> si la palabra va con T es queja. Ok. Una queja, dos quejas. Si la palabra va con T, complain. Complain. Okay. Then help. Very good. Ayuda. Request. Uh -huh. Request. Ayuda. Yes, yes. Uh, 
Request information, ajá, ajá. Get okay. prices. Obtener también. precios. Ok, obtener, adquirir precios, all right? Precios. Provide one's information. Proveer información de algo. O de de alguien, proveer su información. All right. Assist. Ayudar. Ayudar. Asistir. Ayudar, right? Buy. What is buy? Comprar. 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 Uh -huh. Call. Llamar. Llamar. Yes, Llamar. Call, your, call your ex every day. Receive. Receive. Receive money. Yes. 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 Ahí les mando mi, mi DUI para que me envíen bitcoins, ¿ok? Por el grupo que voy a mandar. Okay. Aunque, aunque sea un dólar. <laughs> All right, guys, let's continue. Let's continue with part three. No, no, the part two. Sorry. In uh, over here in this part, it says customer and it says company's representative. In the space, in the space here, we're going to write the app from this uh, from this list. We're going to select vocabulary for customers or for a customer, or we're going to select vocabulary from a company's representative, okay? Veremos uh, de las que están acá, de las 12 que están acá, de la lista de vocabulario de 12 que están acá, elegiremos las que van con, con un cliente y las que van con un representante de una compañía, okay? Mm. Ustedes eligen. Yeah, comprar y llamar. Uh, ¿Lo vamos a hacer individual ahorita o se lo vamos yeah. haciendo? Individually. Oh. Two minutes, two minutes. Comprender, comprender, explicar. Uh, A dos. Y... Hola. Okay. I think I believe you finished. What can be guys? What can be the activities for the customer, or the actions for the customer? Bye. Uh -huh. Explain. Explain. Complain. Explain. Mm. Get price. Complain. Customer okay. com no. Let Complain. No. Let me write the list. Get Wait, price. Complains for company. Ask people. Buy. I believe. Help. Call. You said you said get prices, right? Get prices. Call. What else? Buy. Complain. Get Complain. Complain. Request information. Buy. Request. Mm. La diez, comprar, siete. Request information. Help. Buy. Buy. Comprar. Okay, wait. Provide one information. What about, what about, I think request information is from oh. the company. 
Robert, uh, over here, the company is... Pick up the phone. Pick up the phone. Understand. Pick up the phone. Oh. Understand. Understand. Explain. Help. 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 Assist. Help. Help. Call. Uh, no. Assist. Explain. Explain. Receive, come on, receive. 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 That's okay, that's okay. All right. So that's okay. For example, in the, in the in the for example, understand can be for customer and for uh, the company's representative. Uh, explain can be for, for from the customer or from the uh, company's representative. Okay, yeah, they can be uh, interchangeable. Right, guys, do you have any questions? Questions? Okay. Have something. One more part. Part three. Oh. The part three, guys. Part three says, mm. the department. Listen to this question, please. Choose the department where you're working, and a friend. Explain to a partner what activities you do there. Let's answer these questions individually, okay? Individually, okay. guys. Let's see. We... ¿Qué piden los clientes? ¿Cuál fue la última llamada? Vamos a ver. Piche. Yes. La pregunta esta, la número tres, la vamos a contestar en base yes. a lo en base a lo de la el número dos o la contestamos a criterio de uno. Criterio, criterio de uno. A su criterio. Ok. Give me a moment. Guys, finish.
Guys, you finish. Yes, teacher. Yes, right. I'm finished. Okay, let's chair. Okay. Sandra, share with us, please, your answer. Okay. Number one, what do you customer call for? The customer call for quality in her product in complaints with shipping dates. Number Two, what was the what, what, what the last call you had about yesterday in the afternoon? And what was the call, the, the call about, Sandra? What? What was the phone call or the telephone call about? What was the last call you? I got a teacher, no lo puedo pronunciar. La pregunta es de que, de que, acerca de qué fue la última llamada. Oh, okay. The um, last call is um, for the for the quality. Products? Quality products. Yes. All right. Uh, Nelson, thank you, Sandra. Nelson? Okay. My answer is short. Mm -hmm. The first information of the product. Mm -hmm. And second, my client mm -hmm. was called for get price. Not to get price. Called to get price. Let me share, please. Thank you. Um, what what do customer call for? Order medicine on a daily basis. Mm -hmm. And what was the last call you had about? Inquiring about an order that customer has not re received. Okay, okay, there you go. Excellent. Janet, I love, thank you, Dermi. Janet, can you please share? Yes. Number one, the customer call for payment of service to ask for offers and to report a defective product. And the number two, the last call was to payment of service. Okay, okay, there you go. Excellent, excellent. Carlos, Mario, can you please share? Good. Uh, what do the customer call? The delivery was delayed. Delayed. Uh, delayed. Uh -huh. uh, what was the last call you were talking about? Uh, due to an error, it was not invoiced on the day of the order. All right, there you go, it was not invoiced. Okay, okay, there you go. Uh, Roxana, can you share your answers? Hello, teacher. Este, creo que no la entendí muy bien, entonces. Solo la primerita. Okay, it's okay, it's okay. Um, oh. Information, uh, it, uh, pumps, the pumps, yeah. Information about what, sorry? Uh, sobre ropa. Clothes about clothes. Of offers. Information offered. About offers. Offers. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's okay. That's okay. One more, Fatima, and we continue. The first, uh, the customer called the the check the room price and room reservation. And the second, the room reservation. 
All right, guys, thank you very much for the, your participation and for your effort. We're going to continue here. Okay, and uh, in the book, you can see part four. It's on page, it's not page 29, I think it's page 30. It's page 30, okay? It's not 29, it's page 30. If you go to the book, you're going to see the next part, which is about simple pass and pass of B. Here, we have the information here, all right? Look, guys, pass of B. Past of B, we have B, okay, B has three forms. B has three forms, am, um, is, and are in the present, okay? En presente tenemos tres formas del B, am, del B. Um, is, are, okay? Yes. Now, in the past form, you can see it here. In the past form, we have was and were, okay? Was and were, all right? El B en pasado solo tiene dos formas. En presente hay tres, en pasado solo son dos. All right? In the past forms, uh, we have them here. Was and were. Okay, was and were. How do you say was in Spanish, people? Estuvo. All right, and how do you say were in Spanish? Era. Fue, oh, no. Depending, right? Depending on, on uh, okay. And then we have some uh, subject in, uh, well, let's go over here. Los sujetos, los sujetos con, con el verbo tu bien pasado, aquí están. I was, you were, he was, she was, it was, you were, we were separado, okay? We were and they were. All right, that's how, how it is, okay? I was, you were, she was, he was, it was, you were, we were, they were. Okay? Yes. Question. Any question? Huh? Me. Okay. Um, why uh, why the pronoun I is was where? Hmm. Because um simple. Um is are in the in the in the present. In mm, the present. Yeah. But in the past, in the past, it's just one. Se convierte solo una. En pasado solo se convierte una. Que es was. Okay. El am um y el is en pasado se une. Y se, se convierten en was. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. <laughs> Very good. Okay, more questions, people? Esa parte casi no la entendí, teacher. Ah, ok. Ya, ya la entenderá, ok. Porque, está, bueno, en el presente eh, usamos am, is, are. En el verbo to be. Ahora, el día de hoy, aprendemos el pasado. El pasado solo son dos formas, que es was and were. Was significa era o estaba. Y acá el were significa... Estabas o eras, eras o estabas, ok, y acá usamos el sujeto con cada, con su, con su, con el verbo to be. En la siguiente parte que tengo acá les mostraré cómo se usa o en qué, en qué, uh, en qué área o con qué palabras específicamente se usa el to be en pasado, ok. Gracias, teacher. Don't worry, I'm going to explain this to you here in the next one. Antes de seguir, questions, no? Okay, here we go. Sorry? Mucho le entendí tampoco. Pero, where is, 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 where is
O ah. sea, no, no se complique en la vida. Eh, singulares van a ser was y plurales van a ser were, a excepción del you, en singular, que también sería were. Ok, guys, acá está el sujeto combinado con el verbo to be. Ok, en este momento solo les muestro el, 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 el to be que va con el sujeto, así como está acá. Ok, en la siguiente parte les mostraré cómo se usa. Ok, que es esta parte que está acá. All right. Let's continue. En vez de, o sea que en vez de am, va a llevar was o where. Ex, no, no, no. Sí, sí, el was. Sería was, pero es en pasado. This is the past. Sería, I, ajá, I was. Ajá, I was. Así, uh, like, ah. like the way I have it here. If you see, if you see, it's here. I was. Ok. En, en presente sería I am, que significa yo soy o yo estoy. Acá uh -huh. I was, ya que es pasado, significa yo estaba o yo era. ¿Ok? Ok. Igual, en presente sería you are. Tú eres o tú estás. You were es el pasado. Tú eras o tú estabas. ¿Ok? Yes. Yes. All right. Uh, we continue with the same situation here. Ahora. El B, we use I was, you were, she was, he was, it was, you were, we were, and they were, plus a description or an adjective. Usamos el B en pasado o en presente igual. Acá en pasado con descripciones o adjetivos. Ok. Más bien descripciones, palabras que describan a la persona, algo, algún animal, alguna cosa. Ok. That's how we use it. And I have examples here. I was happy, she was confused, and he was frustrated. Okay. Usamos el be con adjetivos o descripciones. Feliz, triste, hermoso, confundido, cansado, sediento, etc. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ya este es, es pasado. Okay. And In the examples, en los ejemplos que están acá abajo, dice, I was happy, yo estaba feliz. Ok, expresamos mi felicidad en pasado, yo estaba feliz. Y decimos, I was happy. She was confused, ella estaba confundida o estuvo confundida. He was frustrated, él estaba frustrado o estuvo frustrado. All right? Entonces, Usaremos el I was, you were, she was, he was, it was, you were, we were, and they were with a description, con una descripción, all right? Yes, people? Yes? Yes. Yes, teacher. Ok. Usualmente cometemos el error, muchos, uh, muchas personas que están, que inician a hablar, a aprender a hablar inglés, Cometen el error de mezclar el verbo be, que es was y were, con otro verbo en pasado. Eso no es correcto. ¿okay? El verbo be en pasado, lo que estamos viendo acá, solo va junto con un adjetivo. El adjetivo es una descripción, como lo tienen ahí. ¿Ok? No colocamos otros verbos. ¿Ok? Entonces hay el, el was o el were y luego la descripción, así como está ahí. ¿Ok? Yes. No sería correcto, I was go, entonces. No, 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 eso no, eso no es correcto. Eso no es correcto. Yo, ese, sería, yo, yo estaba ir. Como le comento, se usa, si, si usamos, porque el verbo be, eh, confundirlo más con la gramática, es, es, el verbo be se puede usar como verbo, así como está acá, o como un auxiliar en un tiempo, en un tiempo o en una estructura gramatical, que es otra cosa. Okay. Pero I was go, no. Okay. Sí, yo, estaba, yo estaba ir y no, 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 es, no es correcto. Okay. Para decir yo fui. Uh, I went. I went. I went. Ya veremos esa parte de eso, esa parte que está más adelante. Don't worry, ok. Don't worry. All right, guys, 
Ahora. Entonces sería, teacher, I was playing soccer. ¿En español qué quería decir usted? Uh, yo estaba jugando fútbol. Mm. Ese sería no. el pasado. El pas es, 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 sí, está bien, pero lo mezcla con un verbo y ahí es, es, ya no es pasado. Entonces, ¿Cómo Porque sería entonces? Estamos viendo pasado simple, ok. Pasado simple, simple, simple. Que es yo estaba feliz, yo estaba triste, yo estaba confundido. Ahora... Si usted dice, yo estaba jugando fútbol, eso no es pasado simple, ese es pasado progresivo o pasado continuo, que es ah. otra estructura. Ajá. Que se usa el verbo, el, el, el was it were como auxiliar y el verbo es playing, que es con ing, eso ya es otra cosa. Okay. Entonces solo sería, I was play. No, no, eso no es correcto. No, no. no. Ay, es que sí, estoy confundida. Por el, por el momento, Roxana, es, es que play es un verbo. Okay. Ah, entonces solo tiene que ser un como un adjetivo, habilidad. Un, un adjetivo, una descripción, una descripción. Oh. Okay. I was sick. Ajá, es, exactly. I was sick. Yo estaba enfermo. Acá, acá, uh, no, no. What? What happened, Mauricio? No. Wait, give me a second, people. Yo traje una lista de, de adjetivos flatter, dije. Sí, trae una lista. No sé qué pasó con la lista. I was happy. I was confused. Creo que no guardé la última, la última presentación que hice. Dani, vaya a ver, creo que viene papá. Que le borró. Sí, este, este. Dos diapositivas, dos, 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 dos páginas, perdí dos slides. ¿Mm? No las encuentro, que eran las que tenía. ¿Cuál la, era? No estaban los adjetivos. Este, ay, bueno, cosas que pasan. Y aplica sign. Sign. Sign, sign, o sad. Es como triste. Ah, sad. Sad. Yes, sad. ¿Y llorar? ¿Ah? Sorry. ¿Llorar también? No, llorar es un verbo. Oh. Como le digo, solo son descripciones de la persona. Ok. okay. Solo descripciones. Teacher. Yes. Y I was. No. Mm -hmm. I was asleep. Yo era. La cuestión es que no, no, no. No se le escucha. Ah, can you hear me? No se... Sí, pero lejos. No sé si solo yo. Yes, no you. Sirve. Acepto donaciones. <ríe> ok, guys. Busqué en la, en la papelera, tal vez está lo que se le borró. No, es que fue, fue en, la, en, la, en la presentación que se no, no lo guardé, quizás no le puse a guardar. Sí. Ok. Hasta le puse a todos ustedes, estaban ahí con, con un ejemplo. Ok. Vamos a una lista de, de adjetivos. Uh, 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 a list of adjectives. Sick, sleepy, angry, sad, happy. Crazy. Sad. Yep. Crazy. Crazy. Yeah. Yes, lazy. Mm. Hungry. Hungry. Sorry. Hungry, confused, tired, exhausted, exhausted, uh, what else? Big. Sorry? Big. Big. Big, corto. 
Sim, ah, sim. Okay, this is a list, guys. This is a list of adjectives or descriptions. And these descriptions we use with the verb be. Estas usamos con el verbo to be en pasado, en presente o en pasado, okay? But right now it's the past form. All right. Yes. That's what we use. Now, I need you guys, I need you to give me an example, okay? Please give me an example, everybody. Volunteers, go. Me. Okay, Ay, thank you. Con esos teacher, con esos que, que coloco hoy. Yes, you, you can okay. use this one. Or if you have more, if you have more, or if you have different, you can include them, no problem. JJ, please, JJ, thank you. I was happy with my wife. With your wife? <laughs> my wife. Okay, you were happy in the past. Ya no, estaba feliz. Era feliz. Mauricio, hello. <laughs> eh, se oye, se le va la señal. Se oye, se le oye cortado. Imposible. Imposible. Y lo otro se puede decir... We were gone, gone. Gone. Una... Gone, go, ido. Como dice en español, uno, fuéramos ido. Tiene que ser una descripción, un adjetivo. Ido no es un adjetivo. Es hey, de ir. Como no se puede, no se puede decir gone, go. Adjetivo, una característica física de la persona. Uh, no, uh, ok, ok. <laughs> tell me, tell me. Piense, piense, Mauricio. I was, yes, tell me. I was, I was ex exhausted before class. And right now, no. Yes. <laughs> all right, all right. Uh, Daniel, thank you. I was, I was crazy for you. Sorry, Daniel, repeat. I was crazy for you. For me? <laughs> for <Okay>. you? <laughs> wow. For you? Everybody, for you. <laughs> okay, okay. No. I, I respect. <laughs> okay, okay. Si hubiera tu bicha. Now, this is a 2021 revelations. Okay, okay. Oh, very good, very good. Okay, uh, yes, Graciela, thank you. Uh, I was very angry, but not yet. Okay, okay, very good, very good. Francisco, hello, Francisco. Hello. I was... I was intelligent. <laughs> In the past? <laughs> okay. <Yes. coughs> and now it's more intelligent. Ah, there you go. Okay, okay, there you go. Yes, yes. All right. Margarita, please. A wise sat in the afternoon. Okay. Are you happy now? <laughs> yes. Okay, okay. Yeah, she said, I was sad in the afternoon. All right. Juan Josué parece que va a decir algo. No. I was hungry, decía yo, teacher. I was? Hungry or hungry, no sé. De ambiente. Ah, hungry, hungry. Hungry. Uh -huh. Hungry. All right. Thank you, Josué. Mario? Hi. Hi, coach. For example, he was the main crazy who saved my life. Sorry, repeat, please. Mm, voy a quitar esto. Sería, he was the man who saved my life. Quise decir, él fue el hombre que salvó, 
que me salvó la vida. Ok, it's okay. No, es eh. hello, no es. Eh. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Go, Good no es. Eh. Uh, ahorita. Eh, I was tired yesterday. Ok. <laughs> All right. Rubén. Hi, Rubén. Go, Rubén. I was sick because of something I eat. Okay, because of because of something I ate. Ate. Okay. Ate in pasado. Okay. Okay. Rosana. Hello, teacher. Go, Rosana. Go. He he were he were he uh, was uh, tired. He was. Yes, he was tired. Tired. All right, Rene. Hello, teacher. Uh, I was I was happy for selection soccer. All right, excellent. Uh, Wendy, hi. Go, Wendy. Me, teacher. Was. Very happy in the morning. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Mauricio, go Mauricio. Okay, for example, is I was con, confused. Con, confused. With, confused with the class. Okay. For example. Uh, uh, Mario, Anaño. Um, I was driving yesterday. Mm. No. <laughs> no. The, it is, the sentence is correct, but you are not using simple past. I need you to use simple past. Oh. I was ang angry last night. Okay, okay, there you go. Estela, can you tell me, can you give me an example? I know you are driving, but I don't know if it is possible. No, it's not possible. Okay, okay. he's driving. Sorry. It's okay, don't worry. Keep driving, okay, continue driving. Fatima, can you give me an example? I was este I was hungry in the morning. Okay, I was hungry in the morning. <laughs> okay, still like you. <laughs> All right. It was jealous. Me, you. Me. Why? <laughs> I was jealous. 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 All right. It's a shame that I didn't. Uh, have the vocabulary ready. Okay, guys, let's continue here. Okay, let's continue. Now, here in the past form, esa parte, guys, is very, very important. This part is very, very important. I need, I need your attention here in this part because it's, it's very, very important. Let's start. Today we are here, in here we have the simple past. Wait, sorry. Okay, yeah. okay, simple past, regular and irregular verbs. El pasado simple con verbos regulares e irregulares. <clears throat> we use simple past to express actions that are already finished. Usamos el pasado simple para expresar acciones que ya están completadas, terminadas, okay, o finalizadas. Now, en inglés tenemos dos tipos de verbos. Verbos regulares y los verbos irregulares. Okay. ¿Alguien sabe más o menos la diferencia? Do you guys know the difference between regular and irregular verbs? Los regulares, teacher, son los que cambian su estructura, los irregulares, cambian su estructura gramatical, tanto como en el pasado, como en el pasado participio. Y los regulares no, solo se le agrega ED a veces. 
Okay, there you go. Thank you, uh, Noe, for your uh, help there. And uh, Noe is right. If you see here, regular verbs in parentheses, I have the ED or IED, depending on the verb. All right. Let's read, let's read the definition here. It says, we make the past form of regular verbs by adding the IED to the, uh, sorry, the ED, IED to the verb. Help, helped. Call, called. Listen, listened. Work, worked. Okay. Usamos, usamos para hacer el pasado de los verbos regulares, solo ponemos la D, la ED o la IED, dependiendo en la terminación del verbo. Acá está help, que es ayudar. Helped es ayudé. Call, llamar. Called, llamé. O llamó, depende del el, el sujeto. Listen es escuchar. Listen es escuché. Work, trabajar. Worked, trabajé. All right. Yes. Now, uh, let's go to the other side. Irregular verbs. Irregular verbs. In parentheses, it says change the form. Okay. Cambia la forma. Quiere decir que cambia la forma de presente a pasado. No es igual y no se le agrega ed. Okay. Examples. It. Eight. It is in the present. Eight is in the past form. Take is the present. Took is the past form. Give is the present. Gave is the past form. Go is the present. Went is the past. Eat is comer, ate, comí. Take, tomar, o llevar a alguien. Took, tomé, o llevé. Give, dar, gave, di. Uh, go, ir, went, fui. All right. Look at the examples. O la estructura es simple. Sujeto, verbo, complemento. Listo. Okay. The structure, the structure is very simple. All right. René helped his boss with the task. René le ayudó a su jefe con la tarea. Graciela called her clients in the morning. Graciela le llamó a sus clientes en la mañana. Fátima and Daniel listened to the pastor. Fátima y Daniel, Daniel escucharon al pastor. Ah, ok. Mauricio worked overtime. Mauricio trabajó tiempo extra. Ok. Examples with irregular verbs. Mr. Avendaño ate cake at the party. Ok. Mr. Avendaño comió pastel en la fiesta. Estela and Margarita took medicine. Estela y Mar Margarita tomaron medicina. Domenica gave a car to her father. Domenica le dio un carro a su papá. Rubén went to the orphanage. Y Rubén fue al orfanato. All right. Guys, do you have any questions? This is beautiful. <laughs> sé que hay preguntas. La pronunciación... Oh, okay. De los de help, por ejemplo, de oh. call, the list, the work, se me hace difícil. I understand, se entiende. <laughs> en ese caso tendría que buscar, uh, ¿cómo se llama? Porque no está en el libro esa parte, es muy interesante, por cierto, e e también importante. Eh, ¿cómo, ¿Cómo pronunciar el, el final? Porque hay este, una terminación específica para pronunciarlas con D o con T. Guys, more questions? Yes, me. Yes, Sandra, dígame. Ok. <laughs> ok, <Yeah>. Graciela. Graciela. <laughs> ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo vamos a saber eh, cuándo le vamos a colocar D o E, D o I, D? Sí entiendo que usted hizo referencia a la terminación de las letras con las que termina el verbo. Pero, ¿cómo vamos a saber 
en cuáles letras eh, tenemos que hacer la modificación, no sé. Me, me... Ok, uh, las que son más relevantes acá. La, la palabra que termine, el verbo que termine en E, si es de una A ver. Escucha mucha interferencia. Y el verbo. La vez pasada lo pasó, lo dio un listado, dicho. Ese, ese mismo listado ocuparíamos. No, I think so, creo que sí. Ajá, lo dio un listado de verbos. Eran un poco puño de verbos en pasado. Yes, I remember, I remember. Ok, uh, como le decía, el, los verbos que terminan en, en E, por ejemplo, el verbo dance, dance, Termina en E, solo se le pone la D y ya está. Y para la IED es para verbos que terminen en consonante con la, con, la, con la Y. Por ejemplo, study termina con D y la, y la y, 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 Y. Entonces se le, se le quita la Y, y, se le pone la Y latina y luego la ED. Y los demás irían con ED. Básicamente. All right. More questions, people? No, teacher. No, no teacher. Okay. Very good. Here. Okay. Uh, vamos a hacer esta parte que está acá. Okay, let's let's do this together, guys. Help me, help me. Vamos a poner la, la base, la, la forma base del verbo. Ya está en pasado acá el, el, el verbo. Pongámoslo en, en presente, digámoslo así. ¿Cuál es el presente de was y were, people? Be. Mm -hmm. Be, okay. Yeah. What about have? Have. Have. Have, right? Have. What about loved? Love. Love. Slow. What about stud studied? Study. There you go. Study. What about sat? Sit. 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 Yes. Sit. What about travel? Travel. Travel. And clean. What about clean? Clean. And drink, what about drink? Drink. Drink. Drink, right, drink. What about took? Take. Take. Take, right, take. That's the one I was showing you before. What about visited? Visit. Visit. Visit, right. What about rented? Rent. 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 What about came? Come. 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 Game is come. What about like? Like. Like. <laughs> like. Okay, what about spend? Spend. Sandra, relax. And, right. What about made? Make. 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 Right. Make. Stay. 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 What about red? Read. Read. And what about went? Go. Go. Right. What about arrived? Arrived. 
Arrive. 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 What about roads? Right. 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 Okay. Very good people. Excellent. Excellent. Questions. No teacher. No questions? No, no questions. Okay, no questions. very good. Okay, here we go. It says, guys, let's continue with part five. Write the sentences with the words provided using the past of be or simple past. Okay. Como ustedes pueden ver, bueno, hay que arreglar las labraciones. Okay. Algunos están en pasado, otros aún no. Así que pongámoslos en pasado. All right. Take your time. I will give you a few minutes. Teacher. Eh, Hi. Any question? Eh, when I use. And being past and bueno, la cosa es que, vaya, por ejemplo, en la primera dice I be interested brother. Si yo lo convierto en una oración en uh -huh. el siguiente verbo siempre va no, a ser no lo escuché, se perdió el audio. Excuse me. Si voy a hacer una oración en pasado, es decir, una número uno, I was. Yes. Interested. Uh -huh. es, es la palabra in, interest. Interested. Eh, I was interested. interested. Interested no es un verbo, es un adjetivo. Interesado. Ah, ok. Me confundí que está porque tiene al final el ED. Es un adjetivo. Interesante. Ok. okay. Sí. Let's see. Let's 
percent per contact. Finished, teacher. Okay, no, thank you. Did you finish people? Okay, let's let's check this out. All right, let's, let's see. Let's see, guys. Uh, in number one, what do you have in number one? Everybody, I was interested, bro. I was. You I was. To. <clears throat> Bow to. Bow to. Okay, I was interested in the products. What about the second one, number two? Do both. Do both. Yeah, December December. You bought the item in December. Box. You bought the item in December. Okay. What about number three, guys? Can you tell me? G, G, ready. She's read the policy. She's read the she policy. Read the policy. She, read, she read the policy. She read the policy. Okay. Read the policy. Pasado is read. Yes, I'm confused. I'm sorry. It's okay. It's okay. Okay, number four, guys. Number four. Queda igual. Queda igual, teacher. It's the same. A supervisor gave me 
gave me a discount. The supervisor gave me a discount. Okay. The supervisor gave me a discount. Okay, what about number five? <clears throat> He's saying they sent a contract. They they sent send. Cambia send. la E por la T. Ah, correcto. They sent they sent the contract to my email. And the last one, guys. He was he were. He were. He was. He were. Oh, he was. He was disappointed. He was disappointed. He was disappointed. Guys, do you have any questions? Not teacher. No? <clears throat> We're going to continue with the last part. The last part is this. We have six. Okay, here it says number six. Your turn. Imagine you call an old customer to know about his or her satisfaction about a product or service they got from you. Okay. Imagine que le llamas a un viejo uh, cliente para saber acerca de su, de ella o su de él, satisfacción acerca de un producto o servicio que recibieron de tu parte o de ti. All right. Eso es lo que vamos a hacer en este momento. Okay. Questions? Hay interferencia en los micrófonos, en el micrófono, porque cree usted que la paga. All right. Guys, I'm going to create the groups. Vamos a crear los grupos para que participen a la, la conversación. Es una conversación, ¿ok? Acerca de ustedes llamándole a un uh, cliente antiguo, ¿ok? Y le preguntarán acerca de su satisfacción de un servicio o producto que recibieron. Obviamente usarán el pasado, ¿ok? Pasado simple, ya sea del verbo to be o pasado de verbos regulares o irregulares. Okay. okay, let's go, people. Vamos. Hold on. Change here. All right. Let's go to the groups. Let's go to the groups right now. I just created the groups. Let's go over there.
Ruben, Juan, Josue, Rosana. Can you please join the groups? Teacher, a mí me está fallando el internet. Okay. Igual a mí, teacher, tengo problemas de conexión, se sale y vuelve a entrar esto. Ok, ok. All right. Yeah. No, de cajón, vea. Sí. Que no funcionó. Hello, guys. No. Ajá, la, la, la estafa del de Cameron o el televisor. Digo que hagamos el televisor algo más práctico. Bye. Yo voy manejando, así que pero lo voy a escuchar. Ah, ok. Ajá. Ah, pues démosle entonces, Nelson. Go ahead, go ahead. Go ahead. Va, comenzamos con hello, vea. Yes. El que contesta la llamada. Hello, eh. Good evening. ¿Cómo sería? Eh, hello, good evening. O sea, contesta la llamada. Aló, ¿verdad? Sí, sí, sí. Y de ahí le contesta, hello, I am fulano de tal. I am working in la curazao. ¿Qué le pareció la bomba? Central para saber. Yeah, I called you to, to ask you want to get for the center the center pump. The center pump. Del call. Uh -huh. Hello guys, I'm listening. Central. Perdón, teacher. That we sold you last week. Continue, continue. Uh -huh. I that count. We, uh -huh. uh, that we sold you last week. Que le vendimos la semana pasada. Ahí me contestaría usted. Entonces. I called you, I called you to ask you how to like the center pond that we sold you last week. Central, central pump. You buy the I called you to ask you how you like the center fund that we sold to last week. Hey, yeah, I call. Mm -hmm. 
four is back. But I score them. I score this four. Continue, continue. Hello, good morning, Margarita, Sangarias. Okay. How are you? Uh -huh. How are you in the context of that? Entiendo. Entiendo la demora, dice. Entiendo. La... No, es decir, entiendo la demora, pero había, hubo un problema en la con el motociclista Ay. o con el ah, igual, que puede, ¿no? igual que puede campeón cabal ajá pues sí. <risa> hay un ah, vos, vos que sabes está. todas las excusas eso ajá Pro, <risa> <risa> un problema con el envío <risa> con el envío teatro pero ya está cerca. Vamos. Sí. Va. Lo que creo que si quiere lo practicamos. Ve, está bien. Bye. Good afternoon, Miss Cordova. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. And you? Thanks, very well. Thank. Uh, how was the food service on our restaurant last weekend? I was good service and food was delicious. Oh, okay. Could you recommend with your family and friends? Yes, I recommend them. Oh, okay, thank you. Thank you too. All right. Excellent. Finish teacher. Yes, Finish teacher. Yes. Bye bye. Good, good night. <laughs> no, not yet. Relax. Not yet. Not yet. <laughs> okay. No, it's a liar. <laughs> okay. I'm going to go to a different group. Okay. Goodbye. Okay. Okay. A meditar. Uh huh. Oh, oh. Ya lo empiezan a sacar. Oh, oh. No, no, acá que sí. No va. Ah, todavía no, falta un par de minutos. Sí. Vaya, este, de ahí. Ticheri, eh, es necesario que lleven en cada oración el was y también los verbos en pasado. No, no, es no. Porque. Hay cosas para, que no aplican, teacher. Para meter en todo el pasado. It's okay, it's okay. No, 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 no. Don't worry, don't worry. Aquí tenemos frases en presente, teacher. Sorry. También y pasado. ¿va? Tenemos yeah, yeah. frases en presente y pasado. Yes, yes, uh -huh. it's okay. okay. Sí. Ahí, yo, yo, le, yo le puedo responder acá. Yo le, yo le, bueno, le escribí ahí, ahí va. I always wanted when, when wall. Uh -huh. wall. When will you, when will you send me? Send me. Send me. It to me. Send me. Oh. 
¿Cuándo me lo, sí, ¿cuándo me lo enviaría? Okay. I, I send the next. The week, in the weekend. I send a new product in the weekend. And send the next Monday. Yeah. Y le pregunto, uy, ya vamos a salir, Frank, que si le puedo Tan ayudar poder. en algo más. Relax. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> May I help you anymore? No. Sí. Everything else, no. Okay. Ay, no, ya me confundí. Uh, with anything, anything else. Anything else. Anything else. Y cómo me responde? Que ya no. Apure. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, no, ya. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no, thank you. Bye. Bye. Hello, everybody. Who, who, is Hello. Ready, who is ready to present? Hello. Hello, hello. Who is ready? Yes. Who, who is ready? Go. ¿Quién está listo? Ah, who? Oh, I'm sorry. Um, or, Frank, Patiman. Mm -hmm. Francisco is eating. I am ready. Tell me, me. <laughs> okay. 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 Good morning. Good morning. My name is Delmi Gomez. I greet you from the customer service department of If G D. What's your name? My name is Francisco Godinez. The reason for my call is to know if the creams you received last week meet your expectations. I have a problem. A cream was broken. Okay, I understand. I can change the product for a new. Okay. When will you sell me it to me? I send the next Monday. Uh, may I help you anything else? No, thank you. Okay, it's a pleasure to serve you. Happy day. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Okay, Graciela, thank you. <laughs> okay. Good afternoon, Miss Cordova. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. How was the food service in our restaurant the last weekend? I was good service and the food was delicious. Oh, okay. Could you recommend with your family and friends? Yes, I recommend them. Thank. Okay, thank you. Thank you for your prefer us. Bye. I'll be back soon. Okay. Oh, okay. Right. Bye. Thank you. It was thank you for your preference. Ah, right. okay. Yes. Preference. Uh -huh. mm. sí, me dijo, Fátima. <laughs> preference. Thank you, teacher. ¿Qué más? ¿Está listo? ¿Alguien más? No, hey, yo. Okay. Yes. Hello, uh, Noel. Good morning. Do you remember? Uh, do you remember that you bought a TV in our store? Uh, yes, I remember. I bought the TV. Okay. Es, es, excuse me. I was calling to ask about the other machine. 
Okay, what model would you like to know? Uh, uh, Samsung. Uh, I always wanted this model. Ah, the model was cheaper the last week. Ah, uh, okay. Finish teacher. All right, guys. Uh, because of time limitations, we're going to stop here. Let me just take attendance. Uh, Carlos, Mario, and Daniel, se queda este día. Yes. All right. Very good. Let me take attendance and then that's it. All right. Okay. Pendiente para mañana. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Rene y yo. All right, let's continue here. Briseida y Amilet Diaz Gonzalez. Carlos Mario Andaño Peña. Present. Carlos René Rivas Lopez. Present. Delmi Guadalupe Gómez Landa Verde. Present. Fátima mm -hmm. Gabriela Córdoba Rosales. Present, teacher. Francisco Neemías Codini Subrigido. I'm here. Graciela Janet Melara de Cruz. José Daniel Meneses Bolaños. Present teacher. Present, present. Juan José Portillo Durán. No, present. Juan Josué Morales Pérez. Mario Alexander Arteaga Campos. Here. Estela, Maura Estela Barante Fernández. Nelson Domínguez Díaz Alas. Noé Ortiz Carrillo. Presente, teacher. Oscar Mauricio Montenegro. Presente, teacher. Reina Margarita Martínez de Castillo. Presente, teacher. Roxana Elizabeth Méndez Melara. Rubén de Jesús Campos Gómez. Presente, teacher. Sandra Elizabeth Díaz Torres. Here, teacher. And Wendy Domenica Garcia. She is a All right. Guys, questions? No question. No? No question. Okay, then. No, guys, teacher. Thank you very much. I will see you tomorrow, all right? Have a good night. Uh, happy dreams, teacher. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Good night. Good night, people. Bye, guys. Bye, everybody. Bye. See you bye, tomorrow. bye, Sandra. See you tomorrow. Bye, teacher. Bye. bye. Hello, Mauricio, Mauricio, Carlos. <laughs> Hello, teacher. Okay. Do you have any questions for me? Mm, no. At this moment, no. Any, op any opinions, comments? No, creo que vamos, vamos avanzando. Eh, yeah, step by step. La medida que, que, que de alguna manera nos toca que poner en uso, yes. uh, ya sea por, por practicar o o que se presente en alguna situación, pues se siente un poco más de confianza, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. Se va ganando uno la, la confianza un poquito a poco. Y así es, es un proceso, yes. ¿verdad? Yes. Que es lo que al final pues nos tiene acá. Yes. Mejorando yes. el desenvolvimiento, que es el, mm -hmm. creo que el mayor temor. Exacto. Que se dé una situación real. Y es tener que... Pasa. Es lo, que más cuesta, es, es lo que más cuesta, porque uno puede que tenga la, el vocabulario, la gramática, la estructura, toda la idea, 
Pero en el momento de hablarlo es donde ya uno empieza sí, a bajar. Sí, sí, sí. No, y son esos los detalles, ¿verdad? las gramáticas, esto que estamos viendo de los simple paths, todo eso, cómo aplicarlo, o sea, tenemos una leve idea, pues sabíamos, por ejemplo, que el was, para qué era, ¿verdad? Uh -huh. Pero ya a veces en la, en, la, en la conjugación, ya con el verbo y todo eso, pues, sí. pues esos son detalles sí. que, que se van afinando aquí, y la verdad es que sí es... es es bonito, vamos aprendiendo, la verdad, poquito a poco, ¿verdad? Sí. Este es bueno, es que se ha mantenido un poco el grupo, han seguido unos cuantos, sí, pero... Sí, sí, han ido y han vuelto unos, ¿verdad? Y ahí están, a ver, ¿verdad? Si sigue creciendo. No, a ver, sí. la, la, la cuestión es seguir adelante y no rendirse. No, definitivamente no, hay que seguirle haciendo ganas, no, no es fácil, sobre todo. Cuando uno trabaja, pues, es, es más es, 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 es lo que se debe de, bueno, usted debería estar orgulloso, porque imagínese, trabaja todo el día y luego venir acá, así que desvelándose, a sí. cansar más el cuerpo y todo eso, entonces, pues, sí, sí. Eso, 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 sí, no, quiero eso no, pues, debido al mismo estrés cotidiano, todo lo que uno tiene que, que afrontar y todo eso es, es cansado ya ¿verdad? al final porque pues hay que cumplir en todos lados ¿verdad? después que termino acá me pongo a trabajar creo que llevo solo el día de ahora creo que me faltaría ya para la para estar al día con los con los trabajos ¿verdad? en la plataforma eh, después tengo que seguir trabajando estoy haciendo un un reporte que tengo que hacer de lo del proceso del mes de mi trabajo. Uh -huh. De ahí me quedo avanzando un poquito en eso. Eh, igual que un par de cosas ahí tengo que contabilizar unas cosas que nosotros hacemos unos como canjes con los clientes y me han dado una cantidad bastante regular de ellos. Entonces los tengo que clasificar, separar y cada uno tiene un valor, separarlo, detallarlo en una hoja y todo eso. Qué tedioso. Bueno, sí, sí. Una sí. <ríe> Lo bueno es que últimamente estamos así, no sé, quizás tanto proceso. Quieras o no, y que nos volvió a dar lo del COVID. En el momento, pues no me molestó, pero ya hoy posteriormente sí he sentido molestias en los bronquios y todo eso. De hecho, hasta el día de ayer terminamos con mi señor un tratamiento de antibiótico por lo mismo. Pues. Hemos estado medio mal desde la semana pasada. De veras. Sí, 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 infección en los bronquios, hasta con flema y todo eso, o sea, horrible, como que, a pesar de que yo no sentí nada en el momento, pero, pero sí me quedó algún residuo, ¿verdad?, de la enfermedad, Ajá. y eso no, no enfermedad en, en las vías respiratorias, pues ahí estamos, ya, espero que ya con el tratamiento que terminamos el día de ayer ya, Ajá, este pero, momento, Ajá, se le hace mejor en ese aspecto. Sí, sí primero Dios. Y vamos a estar ya de toque normalmente. Ya verá que sí que vamos a dar. Sí, ¿alguna observación que también me pueda hacer al respecto? Pues, no, todo bien. Primera. Todo bien, Carlos. Este, bueno, al principio como que hubo tres clases que no entró, cuatro no recuerdo muy bien. Sí, Entonces, sí. Pero la, la primera, primera, le soy sincero, salí y se me olvidó que tenía la clase. <risa> y, y hasta el siguiente día me puse a razonar y... Y le digo yo a mi señora, me tocaba clase anoche, le digo, era el primer día. Y se me olvidó, sinceramente, ahí sí se me fue de ahí los otros días, es porque sí, el trabajo ha estado pesado, Imagínate. movido, de, sobre todo por el tipo de medicamentos que nosotros movemos, que son específicos para problemas respiratorios, de la mayoría de ellos. Entonces, hemos tenido un auge con ellos, increíble. Entonces, nos ha tocado que trabajar pesado hasta tarde. Y pues como mi zona de trabajo generalmente es fuera de San Salvador. Oh, okay. Entonces ya regresar, ya salir a las 7 de la noche de un lugar de Zacatecoluca, de la zona de La Paz, ya entrar a San Salvador y prácticamente me lo tengo que atravesar todo San Salvador. ¿verdad? Todo San Salvador. Sí, imagino, sí, sí. Porque yo vivo imagino. ya saliendo para el lado de Apopa. Entonces sí, literalmente me atravieso todo San Salvador. Entonces ese tráfico es... Es matador, le doy sincero, hoy día ya no quiero ni manejar. 
<ríe> Todavía no he recogido para el auto fantástico. <ríe> <ríe> ok. Como le digo, no hay, no hay nada malo, todo está bien, participa, todo, todo excelente. Este, solo que siempre procura estar en todas las clases temprano. Y si no puede, sí. pues trate de, de conectarse por el teléfono o algo así para que no pierda los minutos. Por, le ah, estar, sí. en, ajá, por lo menos como oyente. Ajá, porque, porque le, le, le digo porque los primeros tres días que no faltó, que faltó, perdón, pues eso le, le pudo afectar un poquito, le, le ha afectado un poquito en el, en, el, en, el, en el caso del tiempo, me refiero. Sí, 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 correcto. Sí, sí. Correcto, vamos a tratar de estar a sí. tiempo. Perfecto, entonces. Haremos lo posible, Ticha. Un gusto. Un gusto, Carlos. Bueno, gracias. Feliz, feliz noche, que descanse. Cuídese, cuídese mucho. Igual, eh, gracias, hombre. Gracias. Hasta luego. Bye-bye.